What does I can do? To reach another person on the internet, you type an address into your device, a name or a number. That address must be unique so computers know where to find each other. ICANN maintains and administers these unique identifiers across the world. Without ICANN's management of this system, the domain name system, or DNS as it's known, we wouldn't have a global, scalable internet where we can find each other. Within ICANN's multi-stakeholder model, civil society and internet users, the private sector, national and international organizations, governments, research, academic and technical communities are all represented. ICANN's community-driven policy. To keep pace with dynamic technologies and rapid innovation, ICANN enables consensus-driven, multi-stakeholder policy development with broad representation from the global internet community. Competition and choice. From accrediting over 1,000 registrars to introducing new top-level domains, ICANN works to expand consumer choice by fostering competition and innovation in the domain name marketplace. Which functions does ICANN coordinate? The domain name system, internet protocol address allocation, the protocol parameter registry, root server systems, generic top-level domain name system management, country code top-level domain name DNS, and time zone database management. Security and stability. ICANN supports DNS security through technical training and engagement, coordinating and collaborating with the community in the implementation of standards such as DNSSEC. Interoperability. ICANN's work enables new technologies to flourish while maintaining interoperability across the global internet. For example, management of the unique protocol identifiers allows communication using secure connections between users. Contractual compliance. ICANN oversees the contracts it maintains and enforces consensus policies developed through the community-driven process. ICANN's contractual compliance function seeks to ensure compliance with the agreements and the consensus policies. Who's involved? A number of groups, each of which represents a different interest on the Internet. All of them come together with the board of directors. The supporting organizations on addressing, country code names and generic names. The advisory committees, at large, governmental, the root server system, security and stability, and the technical advisory bodies, the technical liaison group, and the Internet Engineering Task Force. How do I participate? Sign up for updates at myican.org. Join one of the many public comment forums on ICANN's website. Attend ICANN's public meetings in person or online to provide input at a public forum or join one of ICANN's supporting organizations or advisory committees.